My man Keith right here, co-worker, take me to the airport. Excuse me, B-78? B-78, yes. Arrived in Seattle, uh, decided to be a little modest and take the train. But now, I'm kind of happy I took the train. If you watch this and you know me, you know I'm cheap. You know, I got my little long sleeve on. Guys, just left the, the bar. Now I'm getting some casual late night food from uh, hey, what's this place called, bro? Albasha. Got a little Greek menu. Wow. All right, guys, coming to the close of a first first night. Guess what I ordered? I ordered a gyro or gyro. As I know, I just came back from Greece and I can tell that this is not authentic at all. <laughs> Here goes nothing. Rise and shine. All right, guys. So, Friday morning in Seattle. Uh, it's okay so far, you know. Still no rain, so that's a good thing. But here's a little fun fact. Did you guys know that the original Starbucks was built right here in Seattle? Personally, I myself, I really don't drink coffee, but uh, I think I have to grab a cup of coffee from the original Starbucks. Also, something I learned last night from speaking to a Seattle local. Uh, did you know that Bill Gates actually lives in Seattle? All right, guys, we just made it to Pikes.
So this is a white mocha reserve from Starbucks and uh, it's pretty good. I don't even drink coffee, but this is definitely pretty good. White mocha reserve. How are you? How are you? Good. Can I get you anything to drink? Oh, uh, yeah, I'll go with a mosa. Yeah, orange, grapefruit, or. Uh, you can grab me an orange. Orange? Perfect. Alright, so we're gonna go with the crab cake Benedict. As, you know, you're in Seattle, so. I'm guessing the crabs here are gonna be better because it's on the other side of the Pacific. So I guess we'll try that. Yeah, cool, thanks, they're all man. excited about it. I'm like, yeah, baby, I'm coming here. Like, oh, they all want to vlog. I get a little drunker and I'll come in there with the yeah. camera, man. <laughs> That's what's up. They're even nice enough to give me an extra mimosa, a grapefruit one as well. Look at that. Now we about to get really drunk. This is my eggs and Benedict. So I tried to cut the Benedict and I just destroyed it. <laughs> Man, this is really quality food. Now I'm here sitting at the restaurant getting tipsy. <laughs> hey man, I'll tell y'all what. I'm not a big day drinker, but I need to start day drinking more when I do these vlogs because I feel good right now, man. <laughs> right now, we're gonna go check out the Space Needle. Y'all see it? I'm telling you right now, it looks like it looks like something off of Men in Black when I saw it on the pictures. So uh, let's go check it out. Two stories, 520 feet or 158 meters up in the air. That is the observation deck. Very tip of the needle is 60 stories, 605 feet or 184 meters. Now the Space Needle was built as the centerpiece of the Century 21 World's Fair. That fair had the theme the age of space, hence the name and design of the building. Apparently the Space Needle was supposed to be a mix of the Eiffel Tower, a rocket ship, and a flying saucer. Best way to explain that choice is it was 1962. <laughs> Seattle is a rare dress. Hopefully one of our bars is open. Have a great time. <laughs> Space Needle is nice. The sun is like hitting us. So I'm not gonna be here for too long. Day drinking kind of took it out of me. Uh, it's getting late now. We're gonna get ready and we're gonna head to dinner. It's a little rooftop bar in Seattle. So uh, let's check it out. Voila, let's go to dinner. Yeah, one thing I'll note so far is that most people in Seattle are definitely not from Seattle. Like, I don't really think I've met anybody yet who's actually been from Seattle or the closer Washington area. Right now, we're at the Conservation. Seems like a nice little restaurant. Yeah, the fries are actually pretty good. Some more aioli. Guys, this is where the next nice rooftop bar is in Seattle. At the Charter Hotel. And it's all the way up there. Hey, 
Yeah. Leaving Fall Grown. It was cool. It was a nice little spot, but uh, these dudes I just met, they're gonna show me what's going on with, what's it called, Bellevue? Bellevue, yeah. All right, cool. Follow them on Instagram. The Instagrams are right here above me. Check them out. And uh, yeah. <laughs> Man, got the bins. all this shit, bro. He paid uh, five hundred dollars a month. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Let's Alright guys, Seattle was fun, now I'm about to head out to Vancouver, go check out part two.